Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to give you some examples of how you can use the app Keynote to create your own logo. In this one here I'm going to create a basic logo and I'm going to use different tools to actually do that. And you can see here I'm going through the different shapes. And one of the great things here with Keynote is that you can actually break the shapes apart. So if you don't want the entire shape, you can actually select the paintbrush tool and you can actually break it apart and you'll see here that I'm going to get rid of the bottom part of this flower so that I just keep the main part. And you can layer different shapes over that. Uh, what I like to do here is regroup the objects after I've deleted what I don't want. And you can see there that now it's one shape. And after this, you'll see that I can add multiple shapes, change them around, use that same break apart tool uh, to try and get the design that I think would work for me. Now, I did this really quickly, but I think if you actually spent a good amount of time playing around with the tools in Keynote, you will be able to create something much better than what I have created here. And what you can see here is I'm holding the, selecting three different shapes at once. If you hold your finger on one and then select other ones, you can move multiple at the same time, as well as choosing whether they sit at the front or the back of an existing picture. So you can actually choose that as well. You can slide different objects around and move them just by dragging them with your finger. And you can add additional shapes, uh, which you can alter to fit over the top. So you can see here that I'm selecting the sun picture here and just dragging those corners so that it's bigger. You press the paintbrush, which you can change the colors with and again, just readjusting different shapes so that they fit within each other here. So again, just dragging those corners. So you can see I've moved the flower to be um, in the center here of, of my sun and my waves here. Again, just experimenting with where I would like things positioned in my logo as well. So you see I move those waves up a little bit higher um, and then that way, um, I can see what works, what doesn't. If I'm not happy, I can just undo what I have just done before as well. So there's a lot of moving around, shrinking objects, experimenting with those sorts of things, changing the order of um, the objects within that as well. So this is just a really basic example of how you can create a logo in Keynote. There's really no wrong way to do it, but really just play around with those different shapes and see what you can create. Good luck.